Actually, real quick, before we start, make sure to go check out our sponsor lineups oh. for your BTS and yes. K-pop merch. Honestly, yes. it's awesome that we're even getting sponsored. Yo, I think you guys saw our post yesterday, cool. too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have a discount code for you guys, 10% off. Pa for, for life. life. Right yep. there, right there. Right there, link below. Okay, go check it out. And yeah, yeah. Let's, now let's get to it. Let's it. continue. Oh, oh. Oh. Well, I think we've seen oh. one, another very bad shook. Up. Shook. Yo, we know the expression karma is up. Bish. Exactly. Is an army. <laughs> so, haters versus karma. Oh. First of all, this video is not intended to hate other groups in any ways. But. I made <laughs> is. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but. This video to show you that you shouldn't belittle a group or any human being just because they have a dream. Exactly. Because you don't know what karma will do to you someday. And excuse me for grandma mistakes, cause we be new I- <laughs> It sounded like grandma. I thought it's like, come on more girl. English, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> now let's talk about case number one. This one is from October 2016. I, I, three years ago. Have... It says, I know right, poor them. That's why BTS don't have any day sangs yet, because their fans weren't focused on YouTube. Oh, look at the oh. little water pistol emoji. Oh! I don't get day sangs because they weren't focused on YouTube. Any day sang yet. Okay. I know okay, I'll, I'll leave plan. Or pour it on. Oh, you're gonna read it for us. Yet, That's awesome. Because their fans is more focused on YouTube. But in November 19th, 2016, which is just one month yeah, after previous one month. tweets, BTS got their first D sang in MMA 2016. And even after BTS got D sang, they still refuse to acknowledge that achievement. They keep comparing BTS with other group. BTS is only one year younger, only has one D sang. <laughs> And this other group is one year older and has 15 D sangs. Huge difference. But Karma is an army. On December 2nd, 2016, <laughs> BTS got another D sang in Mama. Artist of the year. <laughs> but haters gonna hate. <laughs> BTS <laughs> only has two D sangs. <laughs> oh my god. Why? So oh. we're so stuck up just because BTS is 16 is so humble. BTS only what do you get out of the same name? I don't know why I compare. Four years, BTS will literally never achieve that. Be quiet. <laughs> Be quiet. And Karma strikes again. In 2019, <laughs> BTS got 20 D <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> I mean, we did see they got a lot of more. Right? Not, not five, not six, not ten. Twenty. Is the other group oh. still at sixteen? <laughs> Three D sang from 2017. 13 D sangs from 2018 and Dang. 2 D sangs from 2019. <laughs> <laughs> now we should move to case number two. Before Love Yourself Tear Comeback, some people think BTS overproduced song and they believe that Tear Comeback will be flop. And BTS be could flop. never reach 1 million pre order sales. Arm is going for million pre orders. I'd like to see them. Try. Is that what you think? Ratmies? 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 Wow. Wait, what did it say? I want to read. That's messed up. That's messed up. Like, messed what? up. Like, what? Like, what I say, like, rat music. You know, I like to see them try. Wow. See them try. This BTS comeback will be a tragic failure. Mark my words. my words. Their sales won't even reach the sales of the DNA album. Eh. It won't even reach one million. It will be awakening slap to their reality. So get your popcorn ready. Because BTS will be the worst flop in K-pop. Does this like stem from just competitiveness or just or hate? You know, bro. I it's just a, a bit of troll. <laughs> I think it's just a troll. You know. I want to see the army response to that, though. You know those tweets. And also underestimating BTS album oh. sales. They couldn't believe that BTS will ever reach one million sales after Love Yourself tier released. Tier reportedly surpassed more than one million and four hundred thousand pre-orders. Proving that BTS eventually can reach 1 Drink million yourself. album sales in one pre-order. <laughs> it also proves that Tear Comeback was not a flop like what they predicted. Soon after that, some people started using no 10 million no opinion to belittle BTS and ARMY. Oh, that's in a December troll. 2018, BTS <laughs> officially reached 10 million sales according to Gay Own Music Chart. With 5 million album sales from wow. 2018 alone. It's crazy. Look, look at all these groups. I love and look at BTS. I love this so that's much. Because, um, hold up. Uh, it's because they try to say a number that's like, you know, in their mind, completely out of scope. You know, this will and then never that, like, happen. And then they reach that, like, the thing that should never happen. BTS management, Big Kid Entertainment overtakes SM, JYP, and YG. Wow. Hold on, I'm not saying it should never happen. In their logic, this should never happen. And then BTS just defies everything they believe I in. I like what it says. BTS Beautiful. makes Big Kid Entertainment bigger than the big three. 
because it, it is. Oh, BTS. BTS. I love this dude. Big three in gay and sales 2018. Well, proven that tier is wrong, you know. Love yourself, tier. And it's and one group. Self answer. <gasps> Moving to the next <clears throat> case, when BTS were nominated for top social artist <clears throat> in 2017, <clears throat> some other fandom stated that it is irrelevant and they didn't wish to win such award. You all are going to wish you have a BBM as. No, we are fine with all of our faves music awards. I'll pass this to other fandoms. Some of them also votes for Justin Bieber. Just because wow. they didn't want BTS to win. Since my fave does. This is like all ganged up just to vote for <laughs> That Bieber. is insane. For Bieber, I mean, he's good, but like. He's a good singer. It just seemed pretty unfair. Yeah, we respect that it, music. Since the only reason yeah, right, they're just voting. Just because that. Yeah, just hate. Hey. <laughs> what? I'm going to let That's you being so salty, bro. <laughs> but BTS actually got an invitation from the BBMers to attend the ceremony. And thanks to armies, BTS finally become the winner of Top Social Artist in BBMers 2017. They also got more recognition and gained new fans after winning the award. Fast forward to a year after, BTS were nominated again in the BBMers. Some other fandom even started to wish for the same award <laughs> before. Why do people want Korean groups be Western so bad? After, uh, how many weeks do you need to be nominated for a BBM act? <laughs> but, they said that it is delusional for BTS to perform, or having a comeback stage at the BBM as. Why do armies actually think America will actually let BTS perform at wow. the BBM as? That's next level delusional. Just because they hand you social media or award doesn't mean they will allow them to have their comeback on the stage too. They, they, they. Do you people really think <laughs> that a pop group will be on stage in the United F states? But as always, well, why can't it happen stage though? BTS got invited not only as the nominees, but also as the performer of BTS 2018, and their performance will be a world TV premiere for Fake Love. And of course, they also become the winner of Top Social Artist Award for two years in a row. Now we shall talking about the latest event, the Grammys. <laughs> on September 11th, BTS were invited to the Grammy Museum for the first time, but some people act like it never happens. How? I don't remember BTS being invited to the Grammy Museum. Must have slipped my mind up. Well, mayhaps they didn't have any internet in that day. Anyway, in October 2018 Big Hit announced that they have submitted BTS for six Grammy Awards. Mm. Mm -hmm. And as always, there's people who make fun of this. BTS stands think they are getting Grammy nomination tomorrow. BTS stands really think they gonna get a Grammy nomination for their face. Unfortunately, there isn't a Grammy for having Twitter follower hun. It's There's 23 likes on that Fun fact, Big Swit will never touch a Grammy. There's no likes on that thing. Years, they will be forgotten. Jokes on them, haha. Ha, ha. Cause BTS yeah. got their first Grammy nomination <laughs> right after they said that. Even though it's for their album design. It's still a nomination, and it's still an achievement for BTS and ARMY. But of course, I mean, no other K -pop some people were pressed about it, and they can't accept the fact that Love Yourself Tear got a Grammy nomination for Best Recording Package. They said Tear album design looks like the hair on their shower wall. Well, a nomination is still a nomination. At least it's slightly uncanny. <laughs> it is, it is. It's no. still a cool package. <laughs> oh, wow. We got one. And who knows what will happen in the future. Mayhaps we might I never noticed one. that. <laughs> I mean, you could have thought design it. Is a looks cool. Yeah. The designer worked so hard for this. Please respect. Yeah. After BTS got a Grammy nomination. Haters That's a good joke. Though, like, it was, it was. BTS a fucking joke. On, and they come up with this one. No Grammys invite, no opinion. <laughs> but Karma loved BTS so much. On February 4th, 2019, Variety announced that BTS will appear as presenters at the 61st Annual Grammys, which also fulfilled BTS's dream to attend the ceremony. Yeah, I want it. I got it. <laughs> the After song. The I want it. <laughs> BTS were also invited to an exclusive Grammy winners event <laughs> only. BTS was honored with an invitation. <laughs> To take portrait at the Grammy backstage studio, which only Grammy winners are allowed to, to have hey. their portraits oh, wow. taken by hey. the famous photographer Danny Clinch. Hey. Yes, BTS did that. <laughs> That's so nice, now though. Let's talk right? About BTS apparently, it's only for, for BTS people that won their numbers. Grammy winners, but like, more yeah. their limit, while my fave sold out Jamsil 70k and adding extra seats due to high demand. Okay, 
but a year after, BTS Love Yourself Tour in Seoul sells out with total 90k seats in Jam Sil Stadium. They said BTS you gotta love the robotic voice, right? 16k. Yeah. Looks like it was wrong, haha. <laughs> <laughs> LMFAO -O 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 -O. until BTS has concert at Tokyo Dome then you can talk, but for right now continue with these self drags. Well, looks like we can talk well. now, because last November BTS <coughs> performed in Tokyo Dome for Love Yourself Tour and the tickets nice. sold out for two days. So, who drag themselves in the mm -hmm. end, for drag sure yourself. it's not armies. <laughs> Does BTS really think they can sell Zigo Dome? I've said that Karma love BTS, <laughs> but I'm saying it again, because in June 2018, Ziggo Dome announced that BTS concert is completely sold out, once again proving that BTS are capable to sell every dome they went to. <laughs> They're aiming for National Stadium in Singapore LMRO you think you can fill that up? Oh my god. <laughs> filled up during National Day only, so like they expect the whole nation to stand them, LMRO. <laughs> Karma come through. <laughs> Karma comes through. Ah, I swear. This is the first Korean act to perform at the Singapore National Stadium, and they also the first one to sell it out. After all, I guess the whole nation really stand BTS. <laughs> we are living in a world where BTS really think they can sell oh the city. <laughs> they gotta stop. The, the world will happen so soon. Let's talk when their show will be sold out, which mean we will never talk because they wouldn't sell so many tickets. Oh well, well, well. The I like how they're so like affirmative about, you know, right. so sure of that. <laughs> like, you know, you know we, we, I think like you must have a friend in high school that was always wrong as well about everything. Yeah. So it's just nice to have like a little like when they would say like some sort but of it statement. Happen, it's just happened. Crush that statement. It happens every time that they set like a bar, I guess, for for BTS. You know. Which is like, they won't do this, they don't. Exactly, they won't do that exactly. It's like their scope is so limited in their point of view, but BTS is thinking they got no limit. Therefore, the tickets for BTS oh. City Field concert is no longer available, which <laughs> means they sell out City Field Stadium. I honestly amazed how haters always find a way to ridicule BTS and ARMY. Just look at this tweet. OP only said that they wished BTS will perform in Rossabol Stadium someday. This tweet didn't contain any hate towards the other, but the reply under it is crazy. Oh. Keep on dreaming, sweetie. Have fun trying. I love that. It's it actually sweetie. not explicit and less offensive than other hate comments towards BTS and ARMY. But the fact it's patronizing. that they doubt us yes, is, that the yes. thing is yes. ridiculous. It's adorable. But in the end of the day, BTS and ARMY can achieve everything. And BTS really going to perform in Rossabol and any mm -hmm. other stadium. Therefore, today's episode <laughs> of Karma is an ARMY ended here. I'm sorry if I offended anyone. And thanks for watching.